Hello everyone, um, <coughs> sorry, uh, I'm recovering still from my, um, sore throat and issue, I can talk but I just gotta, you know, I'd be fairly quiet, um, but when I saw this twerp, I know I had to do something about this because this was just ridiculous. I was watching this recent YouTube where you guys know as Gilly Master, aka the noob community GTA YouTuber. Okay, so considering the fact that we are how far in? 13 seconds in and he's just disrespected Gilly Master. We can already tell where this is going, isn't it? Now, he recently, like, about 16 hours ago, he made a video talking about the trial hard debate about <coughs> and stuff and other random stuff he just thought that was relevant at the time. But when I watched the video, it was complete, it was honestly, it was garbage. Bro. It was so it's a literal try hard who just e -woed. No? Okay then, fine. One thing that really makes me upset about these new GTA players is they claim that they they like doing military stuff. Right? You know, you ever met those military crews where they're noobs, but they don't... Okay, so we're new. Apparently, me and my friends are noobs for wanting pe the community on GTA 5 to be better by exterminating these retards. Did I hear that right? Because that's why I feel like it was. I don't know how to play, right? <coughs> Another YouTuber that I need to bring up is a shoot. Kills himself again. Shoot him up, YT. He also made a statement not too long ago, a couple days ago, about the try our community. Like shoot him up said, and I quote, we can give a noob, and when I say we, I'm talking about the try hard community itself. We can give a noob a gun that we're using, the exact same gun, and still beat them. Reason why is because our skill has exceeded the point of where we're just obviously better. All right, for the past, what, five years at least, I think? Okay, so you believe that as a, you, you believe that since you're a tryhard, you're better than uh, noobs and thingy. Here's the thing, if my friend Satan was on PS4, he would body the living shit out of you, mate. Sorry. I think around that time, <clears throat> if I'm wrong, correct me if I'm wrong. <coughs> GTA's been out. If you do not know how to shoot by now, either <clears throat> you're a noob or you're just garbage. Simple. There's no other. Okay, so if I don't know how to fire a gun in real life, I aim. I fail at life, basically. Okay then. <coughs> no other thing. Sorry, everyone. Not, no other reason why. A lot of people say, well, GTA is not all about killing. Okay. If that was the... It isn't all about killing. But this retard is about to say... Case, there would be no guns. There would be no cop. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake. <coughs> Sorry. I cough when I detect bullshit. Sorry, everyone. Uh, and I've been coughing like mad, haven't I? Right. So, this place is meant to uh, be based in Los Angeles, or in America, which is, yeah, I know, that, I know that was stupid, but it's in America nonetheless, and in some states in America, you are allowed to uh, hold firearms on you, depends on which state you go to, if you go to somewhere like Texas or something, you cannot help and buy a fucking RPG for fuck's sake, anyway, and the reason the cops are in this game is because I had a conversation about this with my dad. Uh, Rockstar made the cops like that for a reason. And without the cops, it wouldn't be GTA 5 without them. I know as much... Hang on. <clears throat> I know a lot of you guys are going like, no, and all that. But, yeah, my dad's been playing GTA 5 games for quite a while. Cops, right? Because this is what noobs feel like they should do. And I'm not saying this shit, I'm not saying it's not fun to do these activities. 
for all you noobs out there. Rick. Come in here one more fucking time and I will break your legs. Oh, and look, what's that? A grenade. Easy. That's okay to do, right? That's fine. All right, I get it, right? KD you protecting. Jobs, missions. You don't have money. I understand that. But when you step into a realm of PvP, a.k.a. free mode, when anything's possible, you have one solution. If you don't want to get killed, go passive mode. So... <coughs> So basically, I'm supposed to just remain poor, basically. Yeah, fuck you, bro. I don't understand why these noobs complain about tryhards when they can simply fix the, the problem. Even his name is fucking toxic. Just owned you a joke. By going passive mode. I hope you guys understand that. You no. guys literally can go passive mode and we can't do anything to you. Right? Now, a lot of you guys are complaining about, oh, Evo and KD. Now, let me get on the KD. Oh, my goodness. I have to explain this, KD. You believe that KD means that you're skillful, even though it bl you're blowing yourself up. Don't sh fucking come to me saying KD doesn't matter when you've literally just been blowing yourself up so many fucking times. Shit. Being game... So, what Gilly Master said, <coughs> he says, we're worried about the score at the bottom when we kill somebody, right? Now, before that, he thinks that we care about the KD that shows as if we went to our leaderboard and showed at the thing. Well, the problem is, look, as Gilly already stated in his video, I'll give him credit, as he already stated, he says this, we all have mod accounts, we don't care about that KD. We care about the other score that you see if we kill somebody. Now, here's the problem with that. That's true. But here's the thing. You are you keep thinking this is an argument that you're going to win. You keep saying, oh, we obviously are worried about the KD because you're worried about the score. <coughs> okay, I get it. It is a KD ratio. If I kill someone and they kill me up two times, yeah, their KD ratio on that score is higher than me. Right? We don't really care about if our KD, like, because the way you guys are trying to, the way the noob community tries to explain it, they're trying to make it feel like we care about the KD that shows on our leaderboard. You literally have been blowing yourself up consistently throughout this video, mate. You can't legitimize yourself at all. That's not what we're worried about. Yeah, we you simply are. just don't want the other person to go at, like, be up on us. Simple. When we kill ourselves. After we kill them. Welcome to the entirety of the human race, you fuckwit. It's called competitive gaming. Every time I get killed, killed by a wall glitcher, it doesn't count because if they were on... <coughs> Whenever I go against a god moder, a wall breacher, or anything like that, I don't care about the score. Why? Because they're using an advantage... So they can feel better about themselves. But I really don't care. Sure, I'll get mad about it because it's annoying. It's frustrating. That's how the human body works. But I really do not care. It won't keep me up at night thinking about I could have got up on them. I don't really care. Why would we attack them again if we're already at half health? Why would we attack them again if we have cops shooting constantly shooting us at us? That's why we kill ourselves. Now, when we go against other tryhards, we have to deal with this. So, for the noob community to complain about, oh, tryhards, guys, you're noobs, okay? You guys can leave the lobby. You guys can go passive. You don't understand, like, exactly, just, exactly, look what just happened. I get obliterated. Do you think noobs get obliterated? No. Majority of times. Yes. Yes, they do. Because tryhards like you exist. Making this game unfucking playable. No, tryhards obliterate each other. Tryhards go. No. It's tryhards. Even more, no. Tryhards evil against other tryhards. Nope. It's the same thing. We battle each other like this. So for you noobs to complain about. Um, yet again, not a noob. I'd kick your ass with my friends. How we play simply. Ignore us. 
if one of okay so say for an <coughs> so basically he's telling me that if somebody blows up my fucking cargo but like special cargo or something I'm supposed to ignore that try hard that just blew my shit up my hard worked cargo I'd be back in your voice I know, I know, but I saw this video, Dad, on YouTube, and I couldn't leave it to rest. I had to do something about this video. <coughs> us is picking up, but when I say us, I'm talking about the whole tryhard community, and I hope this video is shared. If... 69k view. Oh yeah, and by the way, dude, don't worry, it will be shared throughout the whole entirety of YouTube and you will get hate comments for the rest of your life for being such a dipshit. One of us is picking on you, you can simply leave the lobby. If No, you can leave the lobby because you're a piece of scummy shit and we don't like you. You know you're not good enough to go against that person. No, we are good enough, it's just that you like to be a dick. Then leave the lobby. What are you going to do? You're going to be in game chat complaining about, oh, you're using a rocket. Uh, that's Pierre. You're on PlayStation, mate. Go on Xbox. People will, are a lot more different. Well, I don't know. GTA put it in there for a reason, right? But now you're thinking GTA is not all about killing. <sighs> oh, this kid wants to make me break his legs. Right? If you see a try hard, maybe you should be, I don't know, more aware of yourself. More si How about you get the fuck out of my lobby and leave me alone to grind? How about that? Sound good? You know, uh, situational awareness, right? If you're going on the map... Situational awareness literally gets a car crushing into him. Fucking idiot. Where everyone's killing each other, why would you drive straight through it? I don't... Are you talking about yourself? Because that sounds like a you problem. That doesn't make no sense at all. Now, I understand, like, you guys say, oh, well, he sounds really mad at this. I'm not mad. I'm annoyed. I'm, I'm annoyed about this argument that these noobs are still trying to think. First of all, Gilly Mask, the professional, all you noob YouTubers, even Mr. Boss for the win. I'm just a put. Okay. So, you're having a problem against... Uh, Gilly Master, The Professional, and Mr. Boss for the win. The last two I don't know about, but he's having a problem against Gilly Master and... Thing. I mean... Oh, God. I mean, I don't necessarily agree with Gilly Master all the time, because there's a couple of dodgy things that Gilly Master goes on about that kind of confuses and I disagree with. But that's my opinion. Your opinion, guys, may be different. You may believe that Gilly Master is an absolute legend. But Satan Lima and all the others, we believe in Project Heli and Joker for Life. Well, I believe in Joker for Life. My friend uh, Satan, Project Heli, and uh, Mitch Pro. S O W C. I can't pronounce the name, but Satan looks up to them, and I look up to Satan and Project Ellie. See all your names in there, so I can get views off this video anyway. But all you guys complain about tryhards, and then we watch your gameplay. You guys don't do anything to improve how you guys shoot against other players. Because as you have been saying, we are noobs, so we. Are starting out in the game. And don't forget, dipshit, you were one to, you were one. At some point at the start of the game, don't forget, you dipshit. If you guys don't <coughs> like shooting against other players, then that's you. Tryhards like shooting against other people. We like to kill. Hang on, a survival map, you duck, dickhead. Well, the people. Do you get what I'm saying? For all you noobs out there. No, because I'm not a dickhead. We like to kill people. Other players... Then do it in real life. I don't know. Maybe do it where people won't respawn. Maybe, I don't know, get arrested for fuck's sake. Your logic is so stupid, I'm literally going to beat your ass, mate. On the game. Because it's Grand Theft Auto. 
there's guns in the game to kill people. Yes. For reasons like heists and shit like that. And yes, maybe to kill other players. But then there's dickheads like you who take the game so literally you have to resort to fucking god mode. And then other shit like that. It's fucking ridiculous, you cunt. We, we don't want this game to turn into Sims World while everyone's, oh, we're going to do some jobs and get some motorcycle club. No, 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 no. If we want to kill people, we're going to kill people. That's why they invented passive mode. Every, every word that comes out of this mouth makes me more likely to throw up from bullshit. You guys keep saying, well, Rockstar did this, Rockstar did this. Rockstar added passive mode because y'all know y'all were going to get fucked up. They knew it. And here comes the toxicity. That's my theory. They knew y'all were going to get fucked up. I'm, I'm really at a, like, a loss of words because I watched Gilly's Master video and I was so upset. I was so confused what he was trying to say. When we see noobs play, you guys snipe in third person. And you guys don't even bother asking why the fuck. Uh, try hard snipe in first person because we can move faster. But you, guys... when we see noobs play, you guys snipe in third person, and you guys don't even bother asking why the uh... modded rank. I mean, I know that's not him, but it's his, one of his friends. Uh, try hard sniping first person, because we can move faster. But you guys don't, you guys don't even acknowledge that, right? So when you guys get messed up by one of the try hards, y'all want to act like, oh, he cheated, oh, he's doing a cheap tactic. No, no, no. Well, sometimes, yes, maybe. But that's because sometimes they are cheating, you fucking scammy cunt. Do you know that famous saying, if you can't beat us, join us? No, it's the famous word is, if you can't beat them, join them. But we are not joining you, you scummy piece of shit. <clears throat> and when I say that, I'm basically saying, if you can't handle going against a try hard who's using the tactics that the game is providing them with, then either shut the fuck up, leave the... Nope. Robbie, go... No. Passive. No. Or learn it yourselves. No. How about you be a nicer person, you stop saying BS, and I break your kneecaps. Sound good? That sounds very good in my opinion, guys. What do you think? Break his ankles or his knees? You act like all tryhards started as a tryhard. We were all... You are... Like noobs at one point. Then why are you telling noobs that if you... Now he's contradicting himself. Didn't earlier in the video he uh, say something about... If a noob doesn't know how to fire a gun, then you're garbage or just trash or something. I don't remember. It was tryhard logic, I think. We all decided, you know what? We're going to change the way we're killing. Because guess what? All you noobs all... So you don't want to kill... <coughs> Sorry, guys. This... This is just why I don't watch uh, idiots like this guy, because he's just an idiot. The only thing you guys get excited for on DLCs are cars. That's it. If you, you, if you guys want to do car... Let's... No, that's... No. That's just car collectors. And you pick on the people that don't want no shit. You're like, oh, if he's... If he can't defend himself, I'll go pick on him. Because what's he going to do? Report me and leave the game? No. That's why we, the try-hard hunter community, or the, uh, or as he said, the noob YouTuber community, as he said, rose up to say, you know what? 
we've had enough of this, fuck you, and we're fighting against you. That's, that's why you're getting so antagonistic. Because you're going to, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You won't piss off and let us do this. Well, guess what, mate? If you had the balls to grow a pair, no, I know that was kind of, uh, whatever the word is. If you had the bravery to grow a pair, you wouldn't be bickering like a little child and you'll be able to get on in life. How old, how old is this guy? So this is three years ago. So he sounds at least in his 20s, guys. In his 20s. Twenty plus something, and you're bickering like a bitch. <laughs> Fucking idiot. There's a bunch of communities where you can do car show, uh, car show, you know, things like lobbies, right? Do, like pull up, do a car show. That's not a child hall lobby. So boom, you guys have your fun. But when you step in free mode, so you're saying. <coughs> So you're saying it's our fault for wanting to try and be nice to the free mode lobby players? Is that what you're saying, basically? It's it's basically FFA, unless you're in a crew with your friends and you have your crew friends. It's a FFA. There is no, oh, I'm going to go tell somebody. There is no, oh, like, there's none of that. When you step in free mode... Also, I'm just going to say it. He looks like a tryhard. He has the crew of a tryhard, and he has maybe a couple of crew members of a tryhard. But literally, I'm he's friends of all of these faggots. And they're all like retard names. Like Come on. Also, uh what was it? Uh modded rank. lobby anything could happen why do you think when you guys do missions like shoot em up said why do you think when you guys do free mode missions it says your uh cargo will be broadcast on like you know that's not our fault it's rockstar being dicks but okay <coughs> i'm gonna say what Kelly master said just because the game tells you to do something doesn't mean you will do it. Like, if I told somebody to jump off a cliff, would they do it? With these guys, it's absolutely fucking lootly. Who's that fucking morons? The whole free mode lobby will see where you are on the map. Because that's the point of the game. Is the fact that other people are going to stop you from progressing. And it's a pain in the ass. I get it. Right? I totally understand that, but that's... No, you don't, because you're the type of person who will get... Uh, mods to make money and or do glitches to make money and or buy shark cards So shut the fuck up go hide in your little in your mother's basement Cry about whenever you uh, don't lock on to the oppressor or Don't winch to your mum when your missiles don't lock on to the p51 Mustang because you have no fucking skill Don't come onto YouTube making legitimate good guys look like a piece of shit just shut up grow a pair and maybe we'll get along you faggot even made a fucking game video chat complaining about oh you're using a rock right sorry. because that's the point of the game is the fact that other people are going to stop you from progressing. And it's a pain in the ass. I get it. Right? I totally understand that. But that's GTA. You know, GTA is not supposed to be a nice game where everyone gets what they want. It's called Grand Theft Auto. Theft. Stealing. Oh, thank you for telling me what GTA stands for. I really did not fucking know you mo... <coughs> Did not know what GTA fucking 5 sta stood for. Thank you for clearing that up for me, you spackhead. 
Deep shit. All right, if I see a noob and I'm some, I'm bored, and they're doing a cargo mission, sure, I might ruin it for them. What am I? So you're just openly admitting that you are a tryhard now, not like earlier when you were trying to legitimize your tryhard brothers for not being tryhards. So you're just going along with the fact that you are dicks just for a reason. I'm supposed to do like, oh, have a nice day. No. If I feel like ruining it, I'm going to ruin it. I'm that, we're that type of player. That's what tryhards do. A lot of you noobs think that the, only, the tryhards only pick on you guys. You don't understand that we have tryhards that don't like other tryhards. We fight each other. We're not tryhards. We're, tri we're evil Scotsmen. That's what uh, Satan uh, calls his... Um, uh, see... I went for try hard hunters, but it wasn't really a uh, agreement. It was more of a uh, nah. We need to be called something else. And then Satan said, "Evil Scotsman." I might actually make that crew if I can. Yeah, we will hunt your try hard bitch ass down and break it. And what? Whatever, dumbass. This guy is so stupid, it's actually causing my brain cells to try and comprehend how much his brain is working. Majority of times, if you look at the lobby I'm in <coughs> right now, it's an all try hard lobby. A noob would not last one second in here. So, a lot of things, another... <clears throat> I don't know where you were for 2018, but not try... Being in a non try hard lobby was almost impossible. Because tryhards were fucking hiding in plain sight. Okay, dumbass. Now, if you are done criticizing the good guys for being good guys, would you mind fucking off so we could actually enjoy the game? Thing is, Ghibli Master started talking about these exposed videos. Like, talking about, oh, get exposed with one old screenshot. Now, look, I agree with you on that, Ghibli Master, but you're thinking on only the behalf of the new community. You're not thinking of... No. He's thinking of the, the community that matters. Your community does not fucking matter. About the <clears throat> tryhard community. <coughs> Tryhards still care about a game. And sure, it's stupid. No, you don't. You want the game to be ruined and you want to be the only one playing the fucking game. Shut the fuck up. It, but they care. So for you to try to call everyone out just because you don't think that way, it just makes you... Literally, like, retarded as hell. You're, you're... Says the retard who's been blowing himself up for 39 minutes straight after killing somebody. It's like one-sided... You're looking at one side of the argument. You're not... No, Gilly Master looks on both sides of the argument and you're just being a retard and trying to look... And you're trying to do what you think that Gilly Master is doing. Spaz. Thinking about, oh, if, if let's say you were a try-hard Gilly, how would you feel about this? Hmm? You would be. But he isn't a tryhard because he's not a scummy piece of shit. You were just a dick. Be confused too. <coughs> it's just basically like opposite sides. That's what's going on here. You're not you're not putting yourself in someone else's shoes, right? And I'm not just saying Gilly Mass. I'm talking about the professional. I'm talking about Mr. Boss for the win. I'm talking about for all those people. The game's been out for five years. How long are we supposed to be excited for just cars? I haven't bought cars in like the past five updates of GTA. Because it's just a waste of money. It's literally... And for saying that, Satan would send your ass to hell with me get punching you along the way. Because, mate, dickheads like you need to die. So, you're basically, you're saying that buying a Toreador, which is a car, is useless. Or the Stromberg, as... Because this was 2018 and uh, doing, yeah. Just a waste of money. All we have, a lot of trial hearts, we have money, and a lot of people say, oh, you guys have money accounts because you guys want to buy everything. Literally, we just want money so we can have ammo. <laughs> no. That was bullshit. The, the laugh at the end was a sign of lies. Honestly, and I, I know a lot of trial are about to agree with me on this, but that's why we have a lot of money, because we just like ammo. Simple. No, you just like blowing yourself up for a living. You stare more at the wasted screen than playing the actual fucking game. 
We need ammo. If we can't, if we don't have no ammo, uh, if we don't have no money, we can't afford to fight, right? And that's just boring, right? Then we're going to end up like you guys doing missions all day. It's five years, all right? For people who are complaining about mod accounts, grow the fuck up. It's five. Says the guy who's literally friends of a rank 2020, which is literally impossible. Five years. The game's been out for five years. I was surprised to anybody who didn't have an account within three years of the game's release. So if you're still trying on a legit account, by all means, and you, and you feel proud about that, go ahead. But just know every tryhard that you have seen all started on a legit account. It's called... Yeah, and then they were skilled tryhards. And then they turned into dickheads like you where they had no skill whatsoever. Moving on, it's called evolving into a better player. We Better? Excuse me, when does killing yourself make you better? Like to kill people. We like to kill other players. That's the point of the game. It, I, I get it. The point of the game is to make money. And yes, it does. he does make a legitimate point where Rockstar shows you up on the map. But that is because Rockstar are dicks. You are just a dick. No matter how I look at it, mate, you're the scummiest piece of shit on planet Earth. And I hope your parents dropped you at the abortion clinic. You can hang out with your friends, but there's passive mode. What, are you guys mad because you guys see each other in holograms? That's why? Yes, that does take away the, a lot of fun because we can't punch each other stupidly. I mean, who would like to be able to... No, I'd like I'd like to be able to punch my friends uh, as a joke, and I can't exactly do that when I'm in passive. You fuck. Y'all mad? If you guys want to make a private lobby so you guys can hang out with your friends, do that. You guys can't. Some people do. Come into free mode and then get mad when someone kills you. We can because, yeah. Retails like you should not be in this game. You bought the game. What did you expect the game to? Be? Grand Theft Auto, a game where you can grind. Be. If the game had no killing in it, it would be fucking like, <coughs> I don't even know the fucking E-rated. Is that is that one of the things? E-rated games or some shit like E-rated means entertaining, you fuckwit. Like that. Now, it's, a, it's an M-rated game because there's violence. It literally says violence on the case. You're gonna get killed. Thank you for telling me something I already fucking know. And you want to know what I also know? I know that somewhere out there, you're going to jail for being an arsonist. And you're going to get bum raped in a shower in prison. Dude, so suck it up, noob. Why don't you suck it up, you fuck? Community, please suck it up. Because I'm tired of you guys. Why don't you suck it up, stop making fucking channel, and stop bickering like a little bitch? Complaining. About this whole KD, everything in general. Complaining about... But you do care about your KD, as you have just blown yourself up. You literal fucking idiot. Tryhards in general. Because, just because you guys are not good. No, we're good. It's just that scummy players like you, like using cheats to get good. Well, correct, uh, correction. You aren't good, regardless. Regardless. Regardless whether you do use God Mode or anything like that, you're just shit. It's, a noob is using an AK-47 on me. I can use an AK-47 on him. And st are you talking about the Mark II or the Mark I assault rifle? Because if you're saying that the AK-47 is a Mark II variant, I will break your fucking knees. So beat him. Why? It's because we're better than them. So somebody starts shooting me, and I shoot back, and they shoot... And I kill them. Does that that means they're better than me? How does that make sense? Simple. We practice. We we learn new. Oh, okay. So because you've been able to practice, you're therefore better. Even though you try hard to don't practice, they cheat. That's their whole fucking existence to cheat. Whereas new people or noobs, as you refer to them. Have only just started the game, barely know what to do, and aren't able to defend themselves as well. So you're saying that they're shit for that. New tactics on how to shoot people. We learn new tactics how to play. 
No, you don't learn new tactics. You just shoot, kill random players, and if the random person leaves, fuck you. If the person fights back and then you're not expecting that, you either hide, go on passive, or blow yourself up to protect your KD. That's all you do. The way the noobs play, that's just your way. Do you see any of the trap? Because yet again, there are new players. So they don't know what the hell they're doing. I always complaining about, oh, noobs like to do races all day. You think any... That's how I started making money. Why? Why did I start doing that? Because I wanted to make money. When I really first started playing this game, I didn't want to get imme immediately arsonised. And it was part of the agreement with my parents to not go around on a murdering killing spree and create a toxic, uh, toxic community for myself. God knows what would have happened if I came across Satan while I was a, uh, a non-legit dickhead and started worrying about KD. <coughs> <coughs> Name one tryhard who's complaining about what noobs do besides me. Uh, literally every tryhard I fought against bickering about their KD being important and all that. Because I know I just did that shit today because I'm tired of y'all shit. But name before that, name one tryhard who made a video and said this. Uh, we don't like the noobs because they like to play races all day. We feel like that's not fun. Right? No. Because tryhards don't get to kill the noobs in races. That's why. No one does that. Because we mind our business. Right? So. But you literally just said, if you're bored... And somebody's doing cargo, and you feel like doing it, you'll ruin somebody's day. You literally fucking said that, you arsehole. For so the new community to get all mad and start peeing their pants because they can't... How would I say it? They can't do what we do. Is this fucking retarded? No, you're a retard. Not the new players who don't know... Who have barely been playing the game to know any better. But you are just a dick. Because... You think you're all high and mighty just because you, a couple of your friends have a modded account to make your fucking life easier if a tryhard hunter comes along and challenges you to a fight. Anyway, this, this fucking video is like 13 minutes long and I guarantee you none of you guys are going to watch all the way up here. So I'm going to end the video. Honestly, fuck Gilly Master. Fuck the professional. Fuck you, mate, because you're a cunt. You're literally the scummiest piece of shit. You killed yourself throughout the entirety of this video saying how Gilly Master is a retard and all the people that stand up for good. Yes, I admit that sometimes it would be fun to just be able to just mass murder everything and not give a shit. But then that makes you a dick. A mass dick. And I don't go that way. I actually want to have a life, and I want to have friends. Fuck Mr. Boss for the win. Fuck all them niggas. Shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, so you're a racist piece of shit now, are you? Okay. Fuck you, you Nigerian prick. I had the N-word passed, but I didn't say the bad N-word. That's what Satan says anyway. I know I shouldn't say. But if you're white, and you just said the N-word, mate, me and Satan are going to be breaking your legs. And if you are black, no, no, don't say it, don't say it, otherwise your channel would be, I'm not going to say it guys, I'm better than that. Fuck, fuck, fuck. You know what, I might just cut all that out. Oh, I'm just playing, fuck it, I don't even need to monetize it. Alright, anyway, I will see you guys later, bro. So I'm going to sleep. Good night. Please die. Just fucking die. Fucking. Ugh. It's not beds like that that make me just. <coughs> yeah. I, when I saw that, guys, I just had to make a video on it because it's just beyond stupid. As you can tell, my voice sounds very, very shitty. That's because I'm still recovering from the sore throat and shit like that. Um, I might be. I might have the flu or something.
and also Verlez and Fosma. Fuck the both of you. Verlez, if you think insulting how my hair looks, saying that it looks like I haven't washed, had a shower in several days, guess what? I had a shower just before this fucking video, and I'm quite proud of how clean I am. Where do you live? In your mum's basement, eating on tr Doritos every day, pissing on your anime pillow because you have no balls to grow up. Also, Fosma, Satan says, uh, fuck you, you lying little piece of shit, for backstabbing us again. Uh, and also, uh, yeah, guys, uh, I will see you in the next video. Also, Verlaz, if you are in God mode, uh, for that day, wherever the hell you, uh, grow up, come out of your fucking Easter egg shell and grow up here and actually fight me and the boys, uh, let me know, because, uh, I have a pretty tight set schedule. Uh, and also, uh, fuck you. Anyway, guys, uh, actually, I do like watching my videos. Peace out.